don't have any leopard over here. So y'all saw us mount the smart coils on the car and now we are going to be installing my new HP harness. I am switching to a new harness because this one will be compatible with my new distributor and the smart coils. We actually taped it up here some because we are going to put it through this very small hole in the firewall so the tape will hopefully keep the connectors and everything together and keep it from getting caught when we are transferring it through. So we're going to take these wires right here and run them through the back of the intake and they should come out somewhere under here. We're just going to try to hide them as best as we can. Now we are just going to modify my plug wires here. So I'm just going to line it up basically how I want it. Mark it. Let's see here. I'm just going to mark it there. And then I'm gonna, I have new ends for them. So I'm just going to crimp those on basically and then repeat it uh, for the next three smart coils. So you can see kind of where the mark line is there. We cut that off, stripped the end off, and then it exposes the spark plug wire there like that. So what you're going to do is fold it down, then put the bottom of the wire in like that. Push it up just a little. You want a little bit of the wire exposed above, above that line there, like that. You're going to take this tool. Uh-oh. You're going to put it in this last one here. Set it in. And crimp it. It should look like this when you're done. Then you just want to lubricate it a little bit and attempt to stick it in. The lubricant will help with that. If I can even get it in myself.
everyone struggles once. <laughs> and then I finally got it in, um, but you're going to want to push it in far to where you, you can see the terminal kind of peeking through the hole there. And these are our modified plug wires. We got some sleeving on them and new ends. So all we have to do is get them on the car. So it's smart coil and distributor time. So we modified the tune here. So now we just have to sync it, send it to my ECU. So I'm just gonna click send to ECU. and everything says synced. So now we are setting up my distributor. You want to make sure the number one piston is set at 50 degrees before top dead center. And then you're just going to take the distributor here and turn it counterclockwise until that crank sensor turns off just like that. And you want to turn it back clockwise until it turns back on. All right, so we're gonna see if it cranks. I hope it does. That did not sound good. It's a new day. Yesterday, we were a little frustrated. Emotions were running a little high, so we just took a break when it wasn't running correctly, but I think we figured it out, so I'm gonna tell you kind of what's going on. So, basically, the car was idling high, my headers were glowing, the car would backfire when you shut it off and we just really, you know, we just couldn't figure it out. But today we removed the IAC. Um, we thought it was stuck open and it was. And we just made this plug for it right here and that seemed to take care of our issues. So I'm going to let you hear it start up now when the car isn't angry at me. So I am so glad that Colin and I could get this figured out. It cranks up so much better. I am so satisfied with the setup. I think it looks amazing. We still have a few things to do before we leave for Ford Fest on Wednesday. So, and that's two days. So one of those. So I originally ended this video one way, but I thought I'd end it in a different way. So I actually filmed that video back in the summer of 2022 we are now in may of 2023 uh i went to ford fest it was a great event but this is the first time that i'm able to dyno my car on this new setup so we're getting ready to load the car up and head to prestige motorsports in north carolina um they do great holly efi tuning so i'm definitely going to see you know kind of the before and after effects of the smart coils and the high ram um so stay tuned for that video and as always, guys, I will see you in the next video. Bye.